a premonition Things are about to go my way You don't have to see it Just believe it's coming Some things are bound to change Then I see $20 in the street High five the next person I see Kick back to the guy with the sign up special place. It's a place that can't be replicated anywhere because when you walk through those front doors of Canard you have a feeling um, and it's hard to describe but you feel like that sense of belonging. You feel the care that comes from teachers and the compassion um, that they have for you and how they really know your name, they know your story, they're connected to our families and above all um, we as a staff work really hard to ensure high levels of learning for, for every single kid. So what excites me is that I'm part of that staff. I get to help lead that feeling and that love um, for kids and, and, their, and contributing to their curiosity and their passions around what they want to do with their life. So I think um, what's exciting about Canard is we're continuously getting better and we're growing and we have this commitment to um, just improving our craft and sharpening our tools for our very robust toolbox because we know that when we're at our best, our kids will be at their best. You know, the thing I really like at Canard Middle School is you know, kids have the opportunity to get involved in the things that they are interested in. Pretty much any kid can find um, their passion and engage with it and find that connection with the school. We have tons of kids going out for sports every single season, every single year, 6th, um, 7th and 8th graders. Um, we have a lot of school sponsored clubs, um, opportunities for kids to get involved in things like Lego Robotics or Fitness Club um, or other opportunities. Um, and then what's really cool is we have a lot of kids um, taking the onus themselves um, and starting student life clubs um, and finding an adult to support them in that. So if there's something that they're interested in um, that we don't already offer, um, we're finding ways to support kids and, and um, support their club interests. We both did Kennard Volleyball and we might both do Kennard Basketball. Last year I was in Drama Club and I really liked that. I enjoy being in Math Counts because it allows me to do math and to use problem solving in very fun ways. I liked being on the Kennard Tennis team because it was fun. I like the wellness team because we try to help students and teachers at the school. I'm involved in a lot of sports like track and cross country. I enjoy LEGO Robotics because of the team building experience and how many things we can accomplish together as a team and the different innovative solutions we come up with. One thing that I think really makes Kennard stand out and is special about us is the relationships that we build, um, both between adults and students, how we try to foster students connecting with each other and finding a friend that maybe they wouldn't have before, um, either in a class or an extracurricular activity, and then also how focused we are on the adult relationships in the building and how we use those to model the proper way to interact and have a dialogue, have a conversation to collaborate so that our kids are learning those same skills. Collaboration is the engine that drives um, Canard. And I think as we think about that as a staff, we also know the importance of what collaboration, um, how that can Im impact our kids and impact our students and how they learn. So it's beyond just um, adults or even students working together. It's being really clear on how we work together and building that interdependence that we, that, you know, I don't have to be the smartest person in the room, thankfully, that I'm surrounded by other people who bring different perspectives, different knowledge, different experience, and together we can work together to really achieve and progress towards those common goals that we have identified for our team. Our motto of all means all, or our saying of all means all doesn't isn't just something we put on a t-shirt. It truly is what we strive to do, the work we do. We have that in our minds of thinking of all different kind of learners and how do we support them, how do we help them be successful. And I think the great thing with collaboration is that we have teachers in our building that have strengths in different areas. Some can really extend things. Some know how to support from the bottom and work up. And then when we collaborate together, we have those conversations. We take the learnings from each other to be able to create something collectively for the whole group. So we know 
what we can do for kids that maybe need a little more support, but then at the same time, we're supporting those kids that need an extension, and it all comes from us using just our knowledge, but then working together to make some type of artifact or a lesson or an activity that will just support all students. Um, so one of the things that I really appreciate about Pinard is that we focus on kind of the whole child education and really that's in two aspects. Um, first, that kids get exposed to lots of different content areas so while they're taking their core classes and have very strong um, core knowledge instruction in those classes, they're also exposed to really high quality music and art programs. They take world language in seventh and eighth grade. Um, they get to be in technology classes. So it really sparks passions of kids from lots of different backgrounds. Um, and then we have a lot of um, ways that we're looking at students as not just um, the academic side, but a whole child and that they're a whole human. And how do we educate kids to have sound character and to act with integrity even when no one's watching. So I think Canard as a whole tries to really promote kids being all the best that they can be academically but also the best they can be as human beings. And I think the teachers here are really good at saying I care about you as an academic person but I care about you as a person. And I think Canard's culture, that growth mindset, that we need each other, even the way that the adults interact, and that we all need each other, and we all need to sort through problems and um, create solutions with each other, is the way that we model that for kids. Teaching leadership matters because kids get to make an impact for their school and outside of their school. So they get to see a hands-on experience that shows them their potential and their ability to leave their mark in a way that is not self-serving. They get a really cool opportunity to serve here at school and then they can directly view that impact on future generations of canard kids. We have former students who come back every year to see the progress and to say, oh, I helped build that or oh, that's, that's an amazing addition to what we started with. So that, that legacy piece is very, very alive and well here. The story's just beginning Time we did some living I can't wait to hear you say you know, we have a lot to be proud of, and of course, you know, since we opened in 2004, we can definitely look back at our data and our results and know that we have incredible um, accolades and achievements that we have, um, that we that we work towards and should be proud of when it comes to students' um, growth and, and learning, whether it's a John Irwin Award of Excellence or the National Blue Ribbon Award, you name it. Um, I think our, we know our kids are learning and growing, but I would say the thing that I'm most proud about is, is our culture. Um, we know that our students are gonna learn because we believe in them. We believe in each other. And I think that um, sense of belonging and that strong sense of um, ensuring that every kid, you know, that all of us are gonna learn at high levels, that, that's what I'm proud of. We're great academics, but there's some other really good schools in our district and all over America that do well academically. But I think the, the part that we do the very best on to me is emphasizing good character, good citizenship, integrity, honesty, and those types of things that are not testable. One of our overarching mottos is that we can and we will. And one of the things that that means to us is that we can ensure high levels of learning for all students and we will ensure it. It's regardless of where they went to school, it's regardless of their previous academic performance, um, and, and the bigger part of it is that we have this culture of inclusivity and this um, culture of high levels of learning for all, and all means all. Um, so regardless of where the student is coming from, our goal is to help them achieve. I would say this, you cannot find a better middle school in the United States than this one. 